Hi Jan, welcome back everyone for a new re blade review. Um, before I start I want to do an update of uh, yesterday's blade I reviewed. It's this uh, treat blade. I uh, want to lower the points on that because um, <coughs> uh, it left me my cheeks and my neck with a burning sensation almost all day yesterday. and. Um, it's only rough blades that do so on me, so this blade I will not recommend for anyone. Uh, treat it as a plague, it's the best you can do. I'm not gonna use them anymore, they go in the bin today. Uh, today we're gonna use a Russian blade, Perma Sharp. And I have it already put it in my... Sorry, so Perma Sharp made in Russia. Uh, I never used this blade before, but I've seen people using this. But I really don't know their opinion about it. It says sharp. I hope it is sharp but also smooth. We will see. And I used that blade in my um, vintage Gillette Slim Adjustable. On setting 5 and I will use Müller sandalwood shaving soap hard pack Müller silver tip brush all and block after and the shaving balm Nobiru of Sweden and between the passes, I think I'm going to do a face ladder today and I will keep my brush in this warm scuttle here between the passes. So I'm gonna ladder up. Loaded the brush. That should be enough. Paint it on. I squeezed out all of the water of my brush before I load it. And here is what got stuck on the bristles. As you can see it's enough. And it left my soap nice and tidy, no wetness inside at all. I think it's not so good for the soap to be soaked every time now we just need water a lot of it probably I just up the bristles here And it's building up nice. I had a little pre-shave today by the shower, but no pre-shave oil. I noticed it doesn't matter for me to do any pre-shave routines at all. It's all about the blade, actually. If I get any weepers or not. It doesn't do anything for my skin if I use pre-shave oil or not. Or if I shower or not before. This part is, of course, important. 
get the soap and the humidity inside the hair follicles. As you can see the ladder is looking very good now. I think I will do with this. Doesn't feel sticky. I think we are ready to go. Just dry my hands here. start feels very very good what it usually do on the cheeks it's too early to say anything yet Let's see how I'm gonna do this. I think I'll go. It's impossible with that hand. I have to use my left. So far, it feels smooth on the neck. See, I got um, acne here on my nose, just like a teenager. <laughs> Actually, it hurts. So, first pass done. Let's check it over. Oh, I can already tell you that this plate seems to be quite sharp it took very good on my neck better than the yesterday's blade on first pass so go for other second pass let's see what's happened with the With the ladder here in the scuttle during the time. Because if you have too warm water in the scuttle, it seems to humid uh, the ladder a lot between the passes, and the ladder gets very thin. 
We will see here what's happening. It seems like it like it is now. But it's warm anyway. Quite thin. But it doesn't matter because it's very moisture. Pass number two across the grain. It was not much left there on the cheeks because it's a good audio feedback on this racer so you can hear when it takes them out. I know I look very stupid when I do this different kind of things with the mouth but actually after I filmed this I never watched my videos because I'm not I've never been uh, it's very strange that I stand there and do this because I uh, I'm a bit camera shy there is a reason for it actually but uh, I will tell you about in another video Got a little weeper here. I think these weepers are from yesterday because I had multiple weepers down here after my shave with this treat blade. I will never use them again. <clears throat> there are I tested a few blades who left me like the treat blade and it's um, so far it's feather, uh, mercury. Astra Green and Treat. I, the, those blades are not smooth enough for me. I have not reviewed them in front of the camera. The Feather and the Mercury or the Astra. But I'm gonna do that. With this razor. And see if I get the same result as last time. Hmm. Quite good done. Here, it's almost impossible to get clean every time. I think my hair grows in every direction here. But I don't go for BBS. It's impossible to go for BBS if you shave every day. 
the face will look like minced meat and it's a little bit down there maybe I should provoke it to test the blade this is actually against the grain for me on my neck and I usually don't do that but I feel that this blade is both sharp enough and smooth enough to to try that all the way down here my stubble grows I'm very satisfied actually. I have a very close shave. I'm gonna rinse up and I will um, be back in a minute. Now let's get some feedback from the shave with the allen block. It stings quite much here on my neck. Yes, everywhere it stings. Here too. My cheeks too. Actually it stings everywhere. Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna rinse it off a minute. Um, I'm a little bit confused with this blade. It's um, It seems to be very very sharp because I got a really close shave here. I would like to say that this blade is on a scale one for five is uh, at least four and a half maybe five in sharpness it was very sharp it made me complete bbs here on my even on my jaw it's a little bit on my neck here but i didn't provoke it too much um, fantastic close shave and it seems actually to be very smooth as well this blade Super much sharp. Um, I got one microscopic weeper here and one there, but uh, actually yesterday I got very abused by the treat blade, so I think it has to do with that. Um, I can uh, say that I really love this blade. It was a very very good blade for me, and I will uh, absolutely buy that in the future too. And I can recommend it if you have a coarse beard to use that blade, not only for the sharpness because it was very smooth as well. I would like to say five in sharpness and um, maybe four in in smoothness or higher. Very very good blade. One of the best I tried so far. So um, I can really recommend this blade for everyone. So if you have tried this blade or have any other comments, so please write them below. And uh, thank you for watching. Have a nice day, everyone. Bye bye.